Hello everybody, this is the Lysol. Welcome to my week 42 of 2024 roster update for my main account, the Lysol. Let's get started. So for this project, I've put together this spreadsheet to track my progress. I break my farms down into four tiers, five characters per tier, trying to get one to the goal each week and another uh, staged at G11, 12, or 13, depending on what kind of resources I have left. I have two concurrent projects going on, trying to get some older uh, journey guide stuff up to G13 for when I decide I want to go for it. And uh, I've got Jar Jar, GR, Ufus, and DTMG, and my Candorous for my mall team as well going concurrently with this. Uh, as you can see, not much progress here has been made in a while on the G13s, but that's okay. This is kind of a side project. I'm not Afra is kind of a luxury character. I'm not overly concerned with getting it done. Uh, I just want to slowly build up. I'm past the Cairo hump, so it's really not that big a deal. Uh, when I decide to go for Afra, it will be pretty easy, even if I don't have them all at G13. Uh, here, though, I've been making some serious progress. Uh, we've got uh, Death Trooper done at R5. Uh, DTMG is at R5. I might abandon the R7 goal and leave him at R5. And then I have basically all the rest of the sheet at G12, except for Barris at G11, which I might not even bother with. Uh, my Queen Amidala 5's team, I just use Shock and uh, GMY. I know it's not the best comp, but they're pretty good, and I might just wait, hold off on Barris. Uh, Fulcrum and Zori might hold off on them. Zori is a little more important than taking Fulcrum up to R7. Uh, just because I do put that team on defense, but even with the G12 Zori, it still gets holds from time to time. And who knows, Fulcrum might wind up being an R9 requirement for GL Ahsoka, so we'll see how that works out for me. So uh, with the changes to the gear economy and the raid reward structure, it's allowed me to kind of backfill my roster. Uh, these are a bunch of characters that I want to take from G11 to G12 to provide some depth. Uh, and it's just slowly, my goal eventually is to have the whole roster G13, so this is kind of the back half of, back like tenth of my roster basically that I want to bring up. Uh, so I got some Rebel Fighters, some Jawas, some Smugglers, some random tanks, and then some miscellaneous here. Obviously I haven't gotten anything done since 922, but it's not that big a deal. This is a side project and we'll get there when we get there. So I've uh, pre-recorded my gearing. Let's take a look at that. Actually, let's speed this up a little bit. Here we go. So we start by taking Morgan up to six stars. And uh, we're looking here, we get uh, Death Trooper up to R5. And I think that's pretty much all I do this week. I might add some Zetas or something, but uh, this is basically the bulk of what I gotten done this past week. Uh, I'm, I love, the Empire, I love Imperial Troopers, so I'm actually really quite happy to be working on this team. And it's a good team, it's fun. Uh, look, I don't have a lot of mats there. Oh uh, yeah, here we go. So we do take Shin Hati up to gear 11. We take the, uh, the Great Mothers up to 10, and we're able to get Merrick up to eight, it looks like. And then we just take a look here, I'm out of mats. So we don't really get anything done. All right, so tracking my progress here, we went from uh, 11.643 to 11.67, so that's 27,000 GP, that's a good amount. Zeta stayed the same at 275, Omicron stayed the same at 42, G13s went up to 224, G12s went down to 22, and G11s went up to 24. Oh, this was supposed to be the frame where I show the video. So uh, I've been kind of tracking some issues I've been having and possible solutions. We go over this every week. Uh, I need to sit down and, and change this because I do have different problems now, but that's okay. Uh, Kira and Young Han, uh, they're not in my plans, but I do want to put them in my plans so that I can do that. Uh, what is it? Get one special mission in TB. Uh, raid, I'm happy with where I'm sitting on the raid, so I don't need to work on that anymore. High level relic mats, I've been buying those $5 packs for the, uh, what do you call them? The impulse detectors and the Zinbiddle cards. So that's kind of not been a problem. Same with the Cairo Crunch. Slicing mats, I've actually been pretty good on slicing mats, so I'm not worried about that. And my future plans are Lord Vader, Bo, Afra, GL, Ahsoka. Uh, Lord Vader's 
just a ton of relic levels. Bo and Afra are almost there. Well, Bo's done. Uh, and GL Ahsoka, I'm farming the Marquis. Uh, they're all at G11, if not higher. So I'm, it's basically just a bunch of relic levels. I, I don't know if I'll get GL Ahsoka or Lord Vader first. I'll probably go for GL Ahsoka first because I imagine she's more powerful, but I don't know. I, I definitely won't be getting her day one, but maybe within a month or two of her release. So next week, I want to get Stormtrooper up to G13. Uh, he requires three sets of med packs, so that's 120 med packs. Uh, and then he requires two sets of fusion furnaces, so that's 100 of those. And I use those a lot for my uh, Relic 9 scrapping. So I might miss out on a G13 this week, or maybe I'll go a different route. We'll see how that works out. Uh, and my plan for next week, dark side, light side, we're doing Cairo CCBs. Uh, Night Trooper times three and Peridia times three. Uh, Night Trooper's almost done. And then I'm expecting uh, this coming week for who is the next character? Is it Great Mothers or is it Enoch? One or the other will be farmable and I'm assuming it's gonna be a dark side, light side node. So Night Trooper will just transfer over to uh, Great Mothers. Uh, Cantina, we're doing Signal Data and Morgan Elsbeth. Uh, Morgan Elsbeth's almost done though, so I don't gotta worry about that too much. And Fleet, we're doing med packs, fusion furnaces. My goal for next week is to have Stormtrooper at R5, Aphorex at G12, uh, Marquis, all the new Marquis at G11 or G12. So that's it for week 42, guys. Thank you so much for following along, and I will see you guys in week 43. Peace out.